Nutritional Deficiencies in Plant Under this topic, today we are going to study about the Burun Deficiency in Plants. In this e-lecture, we are going to study about the major functions of Burun in plants, deficiency symptoms, soil conditions that affect the Burun availability to plants and management of the Borun deficiency in plants. Let us start with major functions of Borun in plants. Borun is an essential micronutrient. It is essential for plant growth and development, but it is required in very small quantities. The optimum Borun content of the leaves for most of the crop is 2200 ppm but the requirement of boron vary among the crops boron plays a varied function in plants including cell wall formation and stability maintenance of structural and functional integrity of biological membranes movement of sugar into the growing parts of the plants, pollination and seed set. Adequate boron is also required for effective nitrogen fixation and nodulation in legume crops. Boron deficiency commonly results in empty pollen grains, poor pollen vitality, and a reduced number of flowers per plant. Low boron supply can also result in stunted root growth. Boron deficiency symptoms. Boron transport occurs primarily in the xylem channel, resulting from transpiration. Because of this, Deficiency symptom of boron first develop in newly developed plant tissues such as young leaves and reproductive structures. Under severe boron deficiency, stunted development and death of meristematic growing points are common. The first characteristic sign of boron deficiency is the splitting of newer leaves close to the midrib and this symptom is accompanied by unusual indentations along the length of the leaf. Other deficiency symptoms are reduced root elongation, failure of flowers to set seeds and fruits get aborted. Flowering and fruiting are reduced and developing fruit is often distorted. Low boron supply may also adversely affect the pollination process and seed set. The branches and new growth are distorted, thick and brittle. The upper foliage can exhibit a mottled chlorosis. Mottled chlorosis means scattered yellowing of leaves. When the roots are examined, they are often short and stubby. The boron deficiency also gives to a wide variety of effects on different crop plants. And this is evident at growing points in the pith, epidermis of stems and on leaves and fruit. The symptoms for various crops are usually so striking that they have been given a descriptive name like heart rot of sugar beet, canker or black spot of table wheat brown heart of turnips, browning or hollow stem of cauliflower, 
cracked stem of ciliary drought spot or cork or corky pit of apples some of the deficiency symptoms as we seen in this picture the broccoli and cauliflower can develop hollow stems with discolored tissues and in cabbage the leaves get damaged boron deficiency in mango one of the characteristic symptom of boron deficiency in mango is the cracking of the fruits the leaves become lusterless and leathery with thickened veins are other associated symptoms of the boron deficiency in mango brown areas in yellow fruit pulp are other deficiency symptom of boron as the deficiency of boron become more severe and increase in tillering occur tillering means the development of side shoots new shoots have water soaked appearance and they are paler than the older parts of the plant considerable distortion occur along the margins of the leaves finally new growth becomes necrotic and shoots wither the other characteristic symptom of boron deficiency is head sterility in some case the entire spike is sterile the anthers do not open and the ovary does not develop soil condition soil condition also affect the availability of boron to plants boron deficiency occur most frequently in sandy soils with low organic matter content as it is susceptible to leaching and in soils with low moisture content boron is most available for uptake by plants in neutral soil and become less available in acidic or alkaline soil symptoms of boron deficiency will generally begin to appear when available boron in the soil is below 1 ppm and when boron in tissues is below 20 ppm management of boron deficiency the soil deficient in boron can be amended with boron fertilizer such as borax boric acid and solubor it is based on the soil test and the requirement of the crop in high ph soil foliar applications of boron are preferred once the symptom of boron deficiency are observed it is usually too late to apply boron different cultivars vary in their susceptibility to boron deficiency for further readings i would like to suggest following links and the book of plant pathology by george and agrios thank you for watching